Yeah. All right. Hello and welcome everybody to this week's episode of Bear Ski Film. This week we're joined by Shorty Ski. It's Shorty from uh, Bears Country Podcast. Um, yeah, it was actually mine and David's first podcast we ever did. So we uh, we always appreciate you for having us on early on and, and dealing with all of our technical mistakes and whatever else we had going on so uh yeah your, your, your youth in the podcasting world yes our yeah, experience real, real bad, bad talking about playing scared football and if i look at matt eberflus that's kind of the one thing i could say consistently since the first year he's been here i've kind of noticed and and the first year uh, the glaring example came with justin fields there was a game where we had 40 seconds left in the half and we just went and kneeled it. Didn't even try. We we're not even going to try this. And that playing scared mentality, that's reared its ugly head again this last week against the Packers. I mean, Christ, you have 30-something seconds on the clock, right? Like, mm-hmm. when, when the Packers scored, me and David were texting back and forth. And I actually said, you know what? I, I, in my opinion, the season's lost. So now I'm looking for little moments for Caleb to be able to grow. And I go, this is perfect. You have three minutes, one timeout. All you need to do is get into field goal position. Go ahead, rookie. Go out there and do it. You know, because at the end of the day, Trubisky was able to do that for us in the playoffs. It's not his fault to kick a double doink, but he was still able to at least march the team at a clutch moment down the field. And I think that's something that, you know, quarterbacks need to show to do. And what do we get? Sack and another sack. And it's third and 19. And it's like, kid, you're making it as hard as you possibly can for yourself. But props to him. He hits Odunze. Then they convert on fourth down. He hits another nice pass to Odunze. They get the ball down the field. But then you wind up with 30-something seconds. And, I mean, you could go spike the ball and stop the time. Try another pass. You could, you have options. You still have a timeout. And, you know, I'll refer back to a game where Patrick Mahomes had 13 seconds And in two plays, he put his team in position to kick a field goal against the Bills, the AFC Championship, I believe, that went into overtime and they wound up winning. 13 seconds, whatever. I mean, it's still, they just run up there and just let the clock die down. And to me, it's just, that is just the crappiest coaching. I'm watching the the Chargers-Cincinnati game last night. Oh, you took it right out of my mouth, Paulie. uh, Go ahead, Dave. No, I was just, I, I, it was literally the first thing I wrote down is a lot of Matt Eberflus's mistakes would be much more um, easy to justify if the guy that you probably could have hired and chose not to. And if I thought Jim Harbaugh was a petty guy, I think he was doing it on purpose, but it's just, it's not possible because the situation just can't be doing it, but he's just doing it almost. He did both situations that Matt Eberflus fucked up most recently within the same minute of the same game. And he took that J.K. Dobbins run on first and 10 with about 40 seconds left or whatever it was, and they scored a touchdown off of it. And then right before Cincinnati was about to throw the Hail Mary, guess what he did with his last timeout? With his last timeout right before the Hail Mary, he didn't Let's make sure we three. got this right. He didn't put a, he didn't put a spy on, on Joe Burrow. He blitzed him put a little bit of extra pressure on him and guess what guess what happens success it's almost like he's doing it on purpose the 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 tiny examples are right there in your face same week 4 hours later and that's what makes it even more obvious which is a good thing cuz we it needs to be obvious to everybody this guy's a fucking moron um it's it's been obvious for to me and you for a while and it's just it's painful because it's all avoidable 